Let's make this quick. Bachelor's on in 20. <laughs> yeah, but you're not gonna be watching it. You ready? Good game, honey. In a true low budget fashion, we jumped into pre production for serving time a week before the shoot day. Fitting production into our cast and crew schedules was tough, leaving this one Sunday to complete an ambitious idea. Our DP Sam here is showing off our rigged up camera, and underneath all that junk is just a Sony A7S and adapted vintage lenses, rocking some extra hardware for follow focus and matte box. The two Takamars Sam picked from his collection were the 50mm f1.8 and 28mm f3.5. This package is quite affordable and can create beautiful images, understanding some limitations. Audio was captured by this pretty simple boom setup with a Tascam recorder mounted directly to the boom pole. This kept the boom pole easy to throw down and audio wrangler Colton light on his feet when one of his many other roles on set calls. In total, four lights were used for serving time. Our two practicals contained aperture B7C bulbs. These easily could have been replaced with normal light bulbs, but this allowed us some flexibility on set. The main lighting was achieved with apertures Amaran 200X and T4C tube. Additionally, we controlled light on set with simple flags, bounce, and fusion. Two layers of muslin over the window kept the light soft and within the dynamic range of the camera. The beadboard is made from insulation and gaff tape, costing under $15. Having a bounce outside gave us a quick way to fill in our shadows or wrap the light a bit in the harsh backlight of the sun. We've been running random consumer equipment for years to create our films. To us, filmmaking has always been about the team behind the story and understanding our equipment and capabilities. 